Is yoga nidra the same as meditation? Technically, in the Eightfold Path of Yoga, they are separate. So meditation has its own limb, one of the eight limbs of yoga's study and science of human consciousness. Our movement practice has its own limb called the asana. Breathing has its own limb, pranayama breath. Those are distinct practices that are totally interconnected. And then yoga nidra falls into the limb called pratyahara. Pratyahara is the practice of withdrawing your senses, refining your ability to manage your nervous system, to cease the constant desire for external stimuli through the organs of sensory perception. What an antidote to modern life where we are unconsciously, constantly looking for that instant gratification and dopamine hit through the senses. So through the practice of pratyahara in yoga nidra, you absolutely reach meditative states. In the limb of meditation, your intention is different than pratyahara, slightly. In meditation in the yoga tradition, you are distinctly training the mind to be able to focus on one thing at a time. That could be a mantra, that could be your breath, it could be a candle flame. So meditation also helps you learn how to pay attention intentionally, to train the mind to focus. So nidra is more about the somatic nervous system, the organs of sensory perception, and honing your ability to be in your own body, to interocept your physiology, to feel what your body's telling you. And meditation trains that one-pointed focused mind. So imagine what you could do with both practices, with adding in movement and breath work, and there's so much more to yoga's eightfold path. Uh, that I can't go into in a short Insta post, but I'll close with saying that all of the limbs of yoga are doorways into the same room. The eighth limb of yoga is about shattering the illusion of separation, that we can remember and reawaken to non-dualism, that we are in fact interconnected and inseparable from each other and nature.